It's your girl, Them Guys Pop It, aka Lazy Five Free. Check out my hair, check out my page, check out my makeup. I do the closures and the frontals and the lace. Yeah, but I do. Subscribe to me, repost my work, don't show no fake love. T H E M G A L S T O B I C. Or you can find me on IG at Lace Five Free. Hey guys, what's good? It's your girl, Them Gals Topic, and I am back with another video. So I'm gonna get y'all the tea on this. I don't know if everybody know now or whatever, but then I guess you'll be the first to hear it here. So I was on Google, I was going to check the weather because clearly it's snowing outside. I just want to make sure how long that's supposed to go on. And I come across this little article about basketball wives and Evelyn Lozada so it says basketball wives Evelyn Lozada launches new show after Shawnee O'Neal demotion leak so when I go to the screen or whatever hold on all these little things okay so Evelyn Lozada wants to start over the basketball wild star has been sinking a social quicksand following her feud with beloved co-star OG. Lazada, who identifies as an Afro-Latino woman, horrified viewers when she attacked the Nigerian athlete all season long with insults, slights, veiled as jokes and racially charged jabs. Last week, her brand took another hit when a basketball Insider fed damning news to the reputable website Crazy Days and Nights. News which claimed Shawnee O'Neill's reluctance to acknowledge that Lozada's remarks may have been racist is to blame for VH1's plans to liberate the power she holds as one of its executive producers. Their fear, according to the source, was that O'Neill was driving advertisers and viewers away from the series. And as you can see, there's tweets right here. I'm not going to read all of them. But that's just people reacting to the news. Unfortunately for the ladies, VH1 is yet to deny the story, which has given many reasons to believe that it holds serious weight. Fortunately for Evelyn's fans, she is determined to rise above the chaos with help from a series she shot to give, them insight from, well, give her insight into her world. It's called Living Lazada Uncut, and it will air online and explore the public figure's accent to wealth and notoriety following her humble beginnings as a young girl living in the Bronx, New York. Unfortunately, it's a teaser in the tweets she published to thank her supporters for her birthday wishes garnered these responses on social media. And as you can see, this is what people are reacting to. So I'm going to play the clip, see what exactly she's going to be talking about. Hustle grind, hustle grind, good to great takes time. You accept, I take mine, scoring from the baseline. Hustle grind, hustle grind, good to great takes time. You accept, I take mine, scoring from the yeah. When you walk and talk and move like me, you must have a Bronx mentality. Can never give up the integrity, a pedigree, better let it be. At this level here, we gon' let him see. On my level up, rough for some fresh shit. Rep the word, I better let him see. Hustle up for the win, better be. Are you curious about what it's like to walk in someone else's shoes? How they really have evolved into the person you see today? Why they have made certain decisions and what they would do differently? Taking the time to lean in can help you understand that most people are a lot like you. They're just on a journey in different shoes. I want to give you a sneak peek into my life starting all the way back to Castle Hill. So 
So lace up, strap on, or slip on your favorite pair of boots, and let's take a walk back to my old stomping grounds, the Boogie Down Bronx. I am Evelyn Lozada, raw and uncut. Okay, anyways, <laughs> that was it. Um, I don't know what I get from this, like, I feel like the reason why she probably is getting a whole show, show is because she knows that Basketball Wives doesn't have any plans of having her back on for their newest season. I think that's going to be in Tex Dallas, Texas. But I'm thinking that's probably one of the reasons why she decided to do this show. It's because she knows she wasn't going to be back on Basketball Wives because of all the backlash everything that has happened last season or learning about Shawnee being quote unquote demoted from her executive producer role she's probably thinking well there's no reason to be on there because I won't have nobody to back me up if she's not even in the you know right role to help me there's no point in me being there and yeah, maybe that's one reason that she's chose to go through on her own path and get a show. I don't know. Y'all let me know down below what y'all think about this. Um Also, do you guys think that Evelyn is trying to recreate a new image for herself? Even though she's going back to her past and letting you guys, see, letting us see like where she grew up and how she grew up, do you think she's trying to redeem herself and show that, you know, the reason why she did the thing she did was because of what she been through? Just let me know down below what you guys think. That's just a thought, but. Yeah, let me know what you guys think down below and please do not forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that button that um <laughs> bell to get notified about my videos thank you and, and i hope to see you guys again soon